Hi guys, welcome to Osteo Strong. This is Dr. Becky. Um, for those that I have not met, and hello to all of those that know me. Um, we obviously focus a tremendous amount um, of our efforts at Osteo Strong talking about bone health and um, kind of bone density in general. But I want to visit with you today more about um, bone quality and true bone health versus just bone density. So for the longest time, um, when we're talking about bone health and conditions like osteopenia or osteoporosis, kind of the gold standard has always been to measure our bone density through a test called a DEXA scan. And that DEXA scan measures the density of our bone, compares it to um, the bone health of a 30-year-old uh, female. That's kind of when we reach peak bone mass. So that's what um, our bone density is compared to. And our bone density is then converted into what's called a T-score. And that's how we kind of use um, to gauge the density and i.e. the health of our bone. But one of the challenges with that is it only gives us a very two-dimensional picture or a very limited picture of the true bone health. Because what we're ultimately worried about with conditions like osteopenia or osteoporosis or low bone density is fracture, right? So nobody cares about our bone health other than wanting to um, prevent and avoid fracturing one of our weight-bearing bones, primarily the hips um, or a vertebrae in the spine. So over the years of treating conditions and studying conditions like osteoporosis, one thing that we found is that it really boils down to bone health and the ability of our bone, regardless of density, the ability of our bone to absorb an impact um, and even to a certain extent, even just absorb our own weight bearing and the body's ability um, to withstand even a sneeze or just bending over. So in recent years, there's been a lot of debate on um, whether bone density gives us enough of a picture to determine if an intervention is working. Because really at the end of the day, what we want is good bone quality. And so there are um, about four blood tests that have been developed in recent years to actually determine our bone turnover. Two of those blood markers tell us how well the body is clearing out old, brittle bone. And two of those blood markers tell us how well our body is building new, healthy, flexible bone. Irrespective or regardless of the actual density of that bone. So it's been really, really, really um, fun to kind of watch over the last probably seven to 10 years, the development of these different tests. So at OsteoStrong, we talk with our members a lot about, um, you know, the true fracture prevention and bone quality versus bone density. And while we love to see an improvement on a DEXA scan with our bone density, we know that's not the whole picture. We know that's not the whole story because ultimately what we want to do is prevent fracture. So if you have bone that is actually less dense, but healthier and more elastic and has more collagen, more ability to absorb impact, than a bone that is very, very, very dense, but is more on the brittle side and is not able to withstand um, an impact and is more likely to break, bone quality very much trumps bone density. So in um, the talk of bone health, I hope this has been helpful. There is a link in the comments below um, to some uh, some different research regarding um, bone quality versus bone density and those blood turnover markers and um, the appropriateness of DEXA scans and making a diagnosis and all kinds of fun stuff. Um, I think it's fun anyways, but I'm also kind of a science and research nerd. But um, just a little bit more information for you guys if you want to learn more about that. If you are a member at OsteoStrong and you have questions about this, at your next session, give us a uh, give us your questions. We'll um, visit with you more about that. And if you are not currently a member and are interested in what in the world we do at OsteoStrong, especially if you have bone density, balance, or strength concerns, um, give us a call and schedule your first free session and see if our program is a good fit for you. Um, other than that, have a fabulous rest of your day, and I'll talk to you soon.